Hi, my name is Penny Pearl. I'm a career strategist. Do you know how big and magical being a leader of a company can be? You have a huge responsibility in helping the company grow. You inspire your teams within your organization. You affect your clients and your partners. You know that some leaders are better than others. And I've said in the past in my other recordings how a lot of teams wind up leaving because they're not inspired by their leaders. You also know that sometimes leaders are projecting the perception of leadership through some smoke and mirrors, but they're not really enacting what truly belongs to them. It's so important to know your value as a leader and embracing your value so that you can confidently project that outwardly. It's very much of an evolutionary process that requires you to be vulnerable and also be accepting of making some habit changes. Many companies today, they're really seeing the light and they're changing the structure of their programs so that they can develop leadership better and uh, be more mission oriented and appeal to aspiring leaders because that's really the future of their company. Knowing your value is going to change everything. So it does take some work. And I wanted to share with you three areas that you can focus on. Number one is identification. Really reflecting and focusing on the business impacts that you've made from the past and getting into some of the details so that you can quantify and make qualitative statements about the impact that you've made. The second is leadership growth. Always being open to not only identify, but keep growing so that you can share that with your teams and actually set the example for them because it's it's natural. It's a natural part of the way you are and the way you lead. And finally, sustainability. Continuing to constantly reflect, look at the things you've done, being able to share those details of the value that you offer so that you can inspire the teams to achieve the mission of the company and also to pursue their own leadership aspirations. They are the future of the company and they are the future of themselves. Really, knowing your value is the path for leadership. You need to really own your value because if you don't know your value, how can you truly inspire others? That's why when we work with clients on an individual basis with their career strategy program, we focus on two things. One is absolutely identifying their value so that they can project that and they can see what they're really good at, what their secret sauce is to have an effect on their company and others and determine what path they want to take for their career future. And the second is strategic career networking so that you can find people that you need to share your value with and develop relationships that are going to lead to future opportunities.